The Saints are in sunny Southern California, a place known for its stars. This is just a dress rehearsal for some of the black and gold's leading men. But for others, it's a full audition to see who's ready to take center stage. It's Saints preseason football, and it starts right now. This evening, we're just a few minutes from downtown Los Angeles. Head west to Carson, close to the ocean, about a 20-minute drive, and you're at the StubHub Center, the home of the LA Galaxy, and now, over the next couple of years, the home of the LA Chargers as we get ready for the Saints and the Chargers this evening. Hi everybody, I'm Joel Myers alongside Super Bowl champion John Stinchcomb as well as Sean Kelly. Some positives last week despite the loss in the opener at Cleveland. And we're also going to see both first round picks tonight. The positive at left tackle Ryan Ramchick, but we'll focus in on the entire offensive line. Well, this is a group that if you're going to describe it in one word, it's potential. You've got a lot of potential, high ceiling with this group because you're mixing in seasoned veterans, 12-year vet Zach Streif, Max Unger at center. You bring in Larry Warford at right guard. Then on the left side, you've got some young talent. First round draft pick Ryan Ramchek filling in at left tackle. And left guard Andrus Peets finally found a home. And that consistency can only carry over for him. So for this group, it comes down to the three C's of great offensive line play. How quickly can they get their communication, their chemistry, and their consistency down? Yeah, and hopefully right around the corner for week number one because the first four weeks are going to be a bear for the Saints. Well, we found out about the injury to Dalvin Bros for the microscope, even more so now on the guys at the secondary. And Joel, the eight remaining guys on that cornerback list, only one has more than one NFL season of game experience. And of the five top corners on the depth chart, a combined 18 passes defensed zero interceptions. Tonight we'll finally get our first look at first rounder and now possible starter Marshawn Lattimore. The coaches continue to speak well of P.J. Williams, Ken Crawley, and Devontae Harris, but there's no understating right now the importance of every minute of practice and these preseason games for a very green group at cornerback, perhaps the most untested group on the entire roster. And I know it's old to say, but the weather has been perfect here in Southern California. Great joint practices as well with the Chargers. The Chargers and the Saints coming up next. <laughs> 